Welcome once again to uh, Oogie Sundowners. Now, I'd, I'd have shown you the boat in the past. This boat, this is the, the Catram. I've shown you around this one in the past. Uh, tonight, I'm gonna I'm gonna show you my other boat and how we get there. And uh, and there's my girl. Oh, hang on, no. There's my girl. Probably I can't I can't see it. So I don't know. Um, yeah, and, um, and yeah, this is my boat. You know, you see some of my laundry hanging up. They're my smalls. My smalls. I don't really call them smalls. Mine are getting quite big. But I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Apparently, it takes over a thousand calories to cook a breakfast. So, with the amount of breakfast I cook, that must be at least 2,000. Right? So, I'll get there in the end. I'll get there. So, anyway, we'll go to, uh, we'll go to this boat. I don't even, it's not even got a name. I don't even know what to call it. It's got my fan going again. I don't know. I don't know what to call it. Uh, anyway, we'll go. We'll go and uh, how to rotate this fucking thing. Oh, hang on, there we go. Right. Uh, we'll go and have a look at the other boat. That the other boat. Oh, by the way, it's got a terrible name. Wings of Morning. Oh, who named that? I'm going to rename it Sheila Blue. Sheila Blue, but I don't know which boat to keep yet. I don't just keep this. This is a, this this is a, a mansion. I've already sworn I'm not going to get the I don't get monetized anyway, so fuck it. Uh, oh, sorry for any kids that are watching, but anyway, we'll go to the other boat. Oh, there's me girl. That's how you turn it round. Where's me girl? Oh, you have to bear with me a minute. I think I cut it off. The fucking button's in a stupid place. Hang on a minute. Get, a, get me there. Iron Jack. I'm sorry, Put the phone down a minute while I tie this baby up. This is a uh, Wings of Morning shit name. This is a uh, Amram. Beautiful boat. You've even got trampolines. 
But after cooking them breakfast, better not start bouncing on them. Big pack, which I only use once. Storage down there, storage down there. Uh, this boat is going to be a flying machine. Look at all the uh, solar panels, solar panels, solar panels. I've just fitted them davits, I've just modified them and fitted them. So I can lift me lift the uh, dinghy up there. And there's the dog sheet on exactly where she's going. That's oh, my security. Right, there's, oh and there's a there's the, the quarter berth, I don't know if you can see it. I've cleaned that, that's the first time I've ever seen that chart table. Cleaned it today, it's covered in fucking everything. So yeah, there's the quarter berth. Um, I've been working really hard on this boat this last few weeks. Um, my mate Carl was coming over, but unfortunately he's got a, a, a family emergency and he can't make it, he's got to fly back to, to, to see his parents. So, uh, so anyway, we were going to go on this boat. Uh, the other boat isn't quite ready for sailing. It needs to come out of the water. Uh, it needs anti-fouling. It needs checking. And it needs a lot of paintwork done on the top. Uh, but, but that boat is like a mansion. Uh, this boat is, is, you know, it's a great boat. It's a better, better boat than the other boat. But uh, for sailing, this thing, will, uh, this thing is going to fly. Uh, it's going to be an amazing sailing boat. The other boat not so much but but it's like the you live on a boat 100 percent of the time you're sailing it like a tiny percentage you know what i mean so comfort and it is really important but this boat this boat's not bad but it's uh it's not as comfortable as the other one it's not as, you know nowhere near as big inside uh, even though it's you know it's still a big boat um but i've done all sorts I've, I've not i've not finished paint hang on a sec I think it just set, set fire to my nose hairs. Yeah, I've painted all the deck. I've, I've done a lot of work on the deck. I've, uh, I've replaced a lot of woodwork around the mast. The, the deck was really soft and needed fixing. I've done that. I've painted it. I've painted up to there. But then the cockpit still needs painting. I've started there. And there's the, the helm. We call them helm on a boat. Oh, there's my beer. There's my beer. I better get one of them. And that's my dinghy, my dinghy's a catamaran, a uh, catamaran dinghy, so it goes like fuck. Barbecue, um, I say there, there's a pan around at the boat, and then we'll take you down below. Go on in, in, go on in. I don't know how well you can see it now because it's, it's just about going dark. I've still, I've still, I've still got to tidy it yet. That was my last job, really, before, before Carl came. And uh, so, yeah, I've got a queen size bed there. And then uh, on this side, that's over the wings, uh, out to the I don't even know what you call them. Then bits that stick out the side. Uh, there's, there's that was going to be Carl's bed, another queen size bed. So you got one berth in the back. Um, you know, two double beds in the wings, fridge right next to where I sit. There's, there's actually a, a fridge, a freezer under that as well. I've got a, an oven and a cooker, uh, a full size uh, sink, double sink, a table here with a, a fold out thing, and I normally sit over here, play my computer. And then we go through it. I put this door back on today because uh, I live on my own normally, and and the shit out is through there, so I don't really need much privacy. There's a shit. Well, the shit house is in there somewhere. And then we've got another V. This uh, is called a V berth. This is like it's like a double bed, but either your head or your feet are very very close, so you've got to be uh, very close to your partner. Not really good for a couple of blokes. 
storage. So yeah, see this, you know, you can you can see the difference. That's basically my living area. Um, you can see the, the size difference between this and the boat with no name, if I might call it that. Um, you know, there's a big deal. Like, see, I'm, I'm fucking crawling over the dog. She lies down there and I've got to, like, step around her. Like, I, my belly fits too fine, but my shoulders are a bit too big to get through these, these doorways. And, you know, so that's why I'm working on these breakfasts. Get them breakfasts done. The more breakfast I cook, the more calories I burn. Um, so, yeah. I'm you know, just uh, cracking an Iron Jack. Iron Jack. You know, that's that's me and Sheila. That. You can sit, look at his physique, just like me. So, so, anyway, there's a, oh, look at them beautiful davits. I put them up with a solar panel. I've modified them and everything, cut the legs down, add tougheners, uh, because I'm a welder as well. Uh, but, uh, but yeah, it's, you know, tomorrow all it needs now is tidying, you know, tidy the shit off there. Um, oh, I've got to put a, a, a depth transducer on, which is a, bastard i just can't find anywhere to put it and it won't go through the hole um so yeah I'm, I'm, I'm working on that but like the weather's been really shit this last three weeks three or four weeks it's been just windy as fuck every night and then day now like, i've even you know fit the wind generator you can see that's you know that's going all right now the wind's calmed down a bit now but uh but it's going to calm down this next few days next well tomorrow but it's actually probably not, not enough wind tomorrow for sailing. Um, but so I'm going to finish tidying it up tomorrow. And then on, uh, I don't know, I think it's Wednesday. Uh, I'm going to fuck off. Just, you know, I had this already planned for me and my mate. <coughs> Squeeze me. And, um, but he's got this family emergency. He can't make it. And, you know, and I, and, you know, hats off to him. He's got to look after his family before enjoying himself. Although, I, I, I like enjoying myself, fuck it. And, uh, yeah, so so that's it. This is Wings of Morning. And, oh, it's a, it's a very a very different sailing boat than what I'm used to as well. Like, normally, to, to control your, your jib, which is your front sail, you have uh, a winch at either side, which this has got. I don't know all these fucking winches are for, to be honest. It's got one there. I've not got a clue what that's for. I think it's a laundry line or something. Um, and it's got these tracks here. Two R shaped tracks. One's for the main sail. Uh, and uh, it's called uh, a Traveller. Yeah. And uh, I think. And then the front one. That front one, that's for a self packing jib. Now I've got one that. Your jib, or your, I suppose your Genoa, or your jib, is on the front. That one rolls up a little And then, but this has got another one. So it's, but I can put that there, fasten it to that pole, and it'll, when I tack, or jive, it's like tacking. Uh, that'll be the end of Because I use that, I've got these. I fitted these pulleys and these fit to the Because uh, if you don't have them, the fucking thing will break. So anyway, I don't know what you could hear of that, um, but I sincerely hope you enjoyed another edition. Is it edition or addition or edition? Edition? I don't know. Uh, episode of uh, Oggy Sundowners, and the next one, the next one I do will I'll either be at anchor at the mouth of this river, or I'll be in some beautiful uh, anchorage somewhere. Like maybe set a town called 1770. Yeah, the, it's, it's actually called 1770. I think it was the second town that Captain Cook landed. The second like landing that they weren't a town when he got here. Uh, 
So it weren't really a town then, but uh, it was the second place, I think, that Captain Cook landed back in the early 100s. Um, so anyway, uh, bye for now. Oh, oh, by the way, if anyone wants to come on like a free holiday, I don't know how close this is. If anyone wants to come on a basically a free holiday to all my friends on Facebook, uh, just give me a shout. Give me a shout, like, my mate Carl was coming, and I had another mate, Keith, he wanted to come, but, like, he couldn't make it because of business. Uh, but it's an open offer to anybody. I'm sailing out of here on my own uh, in two days, and it'd be so much better with a bit of company. Uh, and you, you, of course, all you need to do is pay for your flight, which, from England, uh, you could get a, a return flight for about between six and 800 quid. And then when you're here, it's just chip in for food, chip in for beer, and that's it. There's no rent. I'm not going to charge you. Uh, it's it's just you know top holiday. A bit of fishing. We'll get I'll get out about this boat's that wide. I can probably get four rods trolling out the back. Uh, it's 22 foot wide this boat, so I'll probably get I'll probably get four rods trolling out the back. There's a, a good chance we'll get you know cause some nice fish. You know maybe no maybe a shark. I don't know. But I'm a shit fisherman, so I don't know. But anyway, but, but that, and then stopping at beautiful islands, and then end up at Early Beach, which is party town, Australia. Uh, uh, full of, uh, mm, you know, uh, birds, full of birds in bikinis. You sit on the beach, and I'll sit in, sit in this pub magnums, and watching the birds go past all day in the bikinis. Just, you know, if you've got nothing else to look at. Uh, if, that's your, if that's your thing, you know. Um, no trannies? No, trannies probably not a good idea on my boat. Uh, I'd rather not have gays. But as long as you probably keep it in your pants, you'll probably be alright. Uh, lesbians, fucking bring them on. As many lesbians as possible. Get all the lesbians. So anyway, uh, goodbye for now. I hope you enjoyed this this um, episode of Oggy Sundowners. And the, the sun is just going down. It's gone. Missed it. Right, anyway, bye for now. I think it's still fucking going. How to stop it? They can't stop it. Still fucking going. There's no fucking stop button.